Ugh. Hey, what's up, guys? My name's Luke. And I'm Chris. And we just had a rather Inter interesting experience at the beach. <laughs> we first we met at Cracker Barrel. Yep. We Hello. Really in focus there. <laughs> I did it for the first time in my life. And then we decided to go down to the lighthouse. So Luke just went inside the hotel to grab something, and he left his GoPro here. So Megan and I have been taking selfies on it. Hey, Luke. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. <laughs> this is what happens when you leave your GoPro alone with us. So we got all the way there and we're circling around and trying to find a parking spot and there was no parking spot available. And eventually his girlfriend Megan discovered why. What? Why Tuesday? Because for some reason the lighthouse is open all week except for Tuesdays. Yeah, like that, that makes no sense at Guess all. Guess what day it is, by the way. Tuesday. So we were going to go to a lighthouse, but it happens to be randomly closed on only Tuesdays, which makes absolutely no sense. <laughs> yes. <laughs> then we were just like, okay, well, what are we gonna do now? So we go driving around and stuff. <laughs> And stuff. And Have stuff. you ever noticed how much, like, when people are pretending to drive, they steer like an insane amount? You don't do this while you're driving, you do this. So we finally go and park. And then this happened. Aha, I'm filming Chris filming me. Whoa, <laughs> filmception. Don't, don't, don't. don't fall. We're weird. For the record, you have rather impressive balance when it comes to walking <laughs> on Thank walkways. You. We're feeling beachy keen. Uh, <laughs> I'm so sandy. <laughs> I'm doing this because it's so windy. I'm flying. So we have decided to go swimming in our normal clothes. Yeah. This should be fun. Fun. <laughs> you can hear anything. It's probably too windy. <laughs> All right. We're about to charge into there. Fully clothed. Well, halfway clothed. Halfway fully clothed. Let's go. <laughs> Oh. Very slow charge. Oh, God, God, God. So it was it was fun and then all of a sudden Chris goes yeah. because he, he got stung or something and his feet he said it felt like a bunch of um, fire ants or whatever had stung him or something and, and bit me all at once. But he, he more just seemed like really shocked, just like, oh, Ah, that my just hurt. happened. Like, yeah, so we were like, oh, that's weird. Well, it's probably nothing. You're, you know, exaggerating. <laughs> Suck it up, be a man. <laughs> yeah, and then a couple minutes later, uh, we're, you know, we're swimming, and then all of a sudden, I'm, I'm going and I go, ah! and my foot just hurts really bad. <laughs> that's exactly yeah, how we did it, it, too. It is, too, and I think I fell backwards into the water. <laughs> we were walking back, and I was like screaming and hobbling and limping, and felt like a little girl. Uh, basically. I just got stung by a jellyfish. I was swimming and then all of a sudden it felt like a million fire ants were on my leg. Yeah, he got stung too, but just a little bit on his feet. Yeah, not nearly as intense. As we were walking back, we saw a sign that was, that warned people all about, like, danger. And it recommended calling 911. So his girlfriend, Megan, Aww. she called 911. Two of my friends just got stung on the foot. We were just curious if that was something maybe we should come to the hospital for, or... Are we gonna die, or are we good? You're not gonna die. Hey, we think we're dying, bloggers. but we're filming it. <laughs> That's what happened when two bloggers get together. Uh, but anyway, so that was fun. <laughs> <laughs> and a little painful. Just a lot. It was. It actually still hurts right now. It's just sort of like tingling, but you know, I swear it took, it literally probably took like five, ten minutes before it stopped feeling like all of my skin had been ripped off. Ah, um, so we got um, stung by a jellyfish, but we didn't eat it. Jellyfish. We have been through pain. Our friendship has improved because of it. <laughs> we were filming this in like 10 minutes, so it's probably not as funny as it could have been if we spent more time on it. We, but I got a skedaddle. Is this like an emergency exit? We'll find out. <laughs> okay. okay. I'll see you later. I'll seriously, like next time we're going on a trip. Yeah. Um, if you ever in NC, just let me know. Alright, I will. Okay. See ya, man. Thank yeah. you for everything. So in Savannah, my dad found one of his high school best friends. What? Back in St. Simon's Island. Getting ready for dinner. Happy birthday to you. Oh, that's adorable. 
Oh my gosh. The two cutest faces in the room. What are we doing now? We're going fishing. Fishing? Fishing. With fish. lisp. Yes. Oh dang. Looks like that rope's been naughty. I find your lack of sarcasm most disappointing. It almost sounded like Bane. Yeah. Look at my hair. Ow. Ow. Side flop. You realize you've got to beat your record from last year. Yep. How Eleven. many was that? Eleven. Eleven fish. Are you serious? Oh, that one's pretty. What? I'll name him Jimmy. Gimme, gimme, gimme. I will never, ever understand fishing. This is number four. It's gonna eat you. We're bored. Almost midnight, and we're finally leaving. I'm going home to the place that I belong. Cause I'm tired and I wanna fall asleep. That's a lot of hours later. Oh. So, we just called the police and reported that. And now I'm actually going to bed. Dude, today was awesome. <laughs> Besides the, uh, the jellyfish incident. Good night. See you tomorrow.